Hey, welcome to this Windows channel, and this is the check of the Panda Internet Security 2016 as we continue checking out different antivirus software. So, Panda Antivirus is an antivirus that I knew from a little while. Uh, I remember a few clients having that antivirus many years ago. So I was curious as to how well it handles my tests. And, uh, wow. Just, <laughs> I'm really going to say wow. <laughs> uh, first of all, junkware, yes. It wants to install Yahoo and MySearch when you want to install it for the first time. So you got to remember to remove these check marks. I don't know. Yahoo, okay. You know, it's not that I really like that, but... Yahoo, yeah, okay, but wanting to install my search, which for me is one of the worst piece of crap out there, that is almost, almost malware, and you're installing it when you install an antivirus. Okay, it's kind of interesting, and you know the funny thing is that. In my test, one of the files that I download for malware contains my search and <laughs> AVG Internet Security immediately said, oh, that's bad stuff. <laughs> and it's bundled with this thing. Okay, that's really, uh, you know, what a start. You know, I, I just looked at that and it was like, okay. Uh, so, you know, is it easy to install? Well, if you want crap, yes. If you don't want crap, you got to remember to remove these little check marks. So, not really. Now, this is the most surprising of all. And of all the antivirus, this is something. The iCar test that I did. Creating a virus and saving it on my desktop. No detection. Not only could I save it on my desktop, I could even click on it to open it. That's really bad. Downloaded zip files, of course it didn't find anything. And the worst thing, you know what? I right-clicked on the file and said, oh, scan this. Okay, the one I saved, it told me, oh yeah, there's a virus in here. Oh, thank you. You could have told me before, please. And the zip file, it didn't find a virus in it. And it was clearly in there when I clicked the zip to open it. So this is really, really bad. Malware, the two programs I downloaded, doesn't say anything. I could install them. I could do whatever I want. It just doesn't say anything. Talk about crappy antivirus. Memory usage? I'm not really sure. It looks like 20 megabytes, but there's like all sorts of processes that have weird names that I'm not sure is it Panda or something else. So I'm not really sure how much memory it thinks actually. CPU? Low, but then again, I'm not sure which process or Panda or not. 2.3 gigabyte file scan, 1 minute 33 seconds. It seemed to do something, but with the results that I had with how it detects stuff, I'm not really sure it really works. Startup impact, um, Windows says hi, but I got to say that I don't really see much difference in the startup. I don't really see much difference in the um, usage of you know the computer and on the internet, yet again, I'm not really sure this antivirus does anything, basically. Oh yeah, there's one thing that it does do. It has a firewall, and I can tell you one thing. That seems to work, because it kept telling me all the processes that wants to go out, and all the processes that want to access the web. Okay, that's cool, but the problem is, the average person doesn't know what should access the web or not. So why are you putting this in my face? You should be quiet about it, unless it's unusual. No sandbox, sandbox mode, nothing special about if you go banking. Actually, you know what? I'd be scared to go banking with this thing. I'm wondering if it's an antivirus or a virus itself. Just incredible. No web checks of any kind. Um, it tells me that it's supposed to protect, um, you know, my computer with Internet Explorer, Chrome, and Firefox. I don't see what it does exactly to protect. No add-ons, nothing. 
And look at these pop-ups coming all the time. Hey, there's a 50% off now. Hey, you're not, f you know, you're just on the trial, 30 days left. Y you know, you can buy it. I'm not going to buy something that's so crampy. This is amazing. Save browsing on. I don't know what you're doing. Enabled firewall. That's the only thing, basically, the firewall that I understand it's doing something. So, my score for Panda Antivirus is 4 out of 10. And I think even at 4, I'm kind of generous. Because this thing is crappy. But real crappy. So, uh, that's pretty much it. You know, crappy antivirus. One thing for sure, don't at all. Don't at all. Buy, download, or use Panda. It doesn't do anything. I'm sorry. But this thing should not even be on the web. If you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe to my channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. Give us thumbs up if you like the videos. If you have any comments, questions, suggestions, uh, let me know. If you have an antivirus you want me to test, let me know also. I'll be checking it out. And please, please, don't install this. Don't use this. And you, if you have it, you know what? Defender, the basic antivirus in Windows, does a better job than this at protecting you. That's incredible. So thank you for watching.